I'm in shock. Look, I've got a blanket. Hello, fangirls and fanboys of all sorts. My name is Morgie, aka That Strawberry Blonde here. Welcome to my channel. If you have never seen my face before, don't forget to subscribe down below. It literally takes two seconds and it would totally make this poor little fangirl day. Today is a collab, oh my goodness, like my first collab. Uh, obviously, they're not actually here. This is gonna be one of like, what, the three types of collabs? Am I saying? <laughs> Calm down. Collabs, and there's one where like the person's there with you, and then there's others too. There's another one where you just do a video, you all do videos that is similar, and you just mention each other's videos in your video. With any luck, I will put the other girls thumbnails here. So this is going to be a collab with Aline Denise. Did I say that right? Holographic Rainbows. I don't know who all is going to be. Uh, Haley. I don't know all the channel names. But basically everyone on 7AUAT Addicts decided to do a collab. Because some of the girls have smaller channels than the rest of us. Like me and McKenna have over 200 subscribers. By the way, thank you guys so much. We hit 200 subscribers. No, that's probably not a lot, but it's like a huge milestone to me. So thank you guys so much. Expecting a Q&A slash dare thing. Go check out my Instagram and comment some questions and dares or any of my social media. So some of us don't have, some of them don't have as many subscribers as they deserve because they have really good channels. This is a collab to hopefully help them grow. We are all on a collab channel called 7 UAT Addicts. And Once Upon a Time is mostly our main fandoms. We decided to do... A collab video but everybody does a different fandom besides once upon a time but today we are going to be going to be basically doing a video which is I am Sherlocked so let's just get right into it I actually have no idea how this video is going to turn out because this is the first video that I haven't scripted in a while as I have gone to the point where I script my videos. Like, what? I am not professional. I did not script this because I just knew, okay, I gotta do a Sherlock video, but I don't know what I'm doing at all. So I'm just going to be titling this video as I am Sherlocked, and I'm going to explain why, I'm I, why I am Sherlocked, what some of my reactions were, and yeah, just some random fangirly things that are hopefully relatable because that's kind of what I look for when I watch a YouTuber, so you know. What I got into Sherlock was basically, I'd say, maybe last month that my dad, I walked in on my dad watching Sherlock, and I was like, oh cool, that's a fandom, he's watching Sherlock, and I was like, that's cool, because I already knew a little bit about it, so I thought, you know, that's cool. I was like, I'm not going to watch Sherlock, I was like, not probably, probably not my thing. I did not know just how wrong I was. Then I started watching a YouTuber called Just Maddie. She's amazing. She's a fandom YouTuber. You should go totally go check her out. She's close to 4,000 subscribers. So really go check her out. She's awesome and I love her videos. Just Maddie just uploaded a video five minutes ago. Hello, all of you internet potatoes. How's it going? And tell her Marky sent you. And yeah, because she's amazing and like, it'd be really cool if you could like go comment on one of her videos Marky sent you or like that Strawberry Vaughn sent you. And she's such a relatable fangirl. Oh my gosh, I need to call Sherlock and John. <laughs> so then I saw that she was into Sherlock, and one day I was like, I need to watch something on Netflix so I can have something to do before Once Upon a Time season six starts. Because I need, it's, it's, it, hiatuses are hard, people. Hiatuses are really hard. If I got on there and I'm like, okay, Marty, you're gonna watch Sherlock, and you are not going to get attached or obsessed. And you're not gonna be a Sherlocking. You can watch it. You're not becoming attached, okay? No! Uh-uh! <laughs> no! Not happening! You cannot do that, I have realized. I was gonna watch Once Upon a Time as a normal show. Then this happened. So then I obviously started watching it, and you, I guess you can assume how that went. <laughs> I'm in shock, look, I've got a blanket. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mrs. Hudson. I swear when I saw him getting all like, Sherlock getting all like where he could like tell stuff about people when he was like saying like ketchup stains and different things. And then when he went, the name is Sherlock Holmes and the address is 221B Baker Street. 
I flipped out. The name's Sherlock Holmes and the address oh. is 221. <laughs> Afternoon. I flipped out and I knew, okay, Margie, you, you have just become a Sherlockian. Then I finished the whole dang thing in a week. And now I have to be quiet about stuff because my dad hasn't finished the series still. There's three series, not season, they're called series, and there's three episodes for that, except in this third one, there's a spe two hour special of that thing where they go back in time. It's like so cool. They're all an hour and 30 minutes, so they're like little mini movies. Got into it, and I didn't think that I was like fully attached until the end of series two when I reacted like I did which went a little bit like this. First, I was watching in the living room, and then I figured out what was going to happen. I said, I need a smaller screen. I don't know why, so I came in here, I got my phone, and by the end of that scene, my phone was wet. I'm not kidding, because I needed to hold it to my face. It was wet. Then I figured out that what I what I suspected was going to happen happened and I screamed like yeah I called it called it called it I'm just going to get more so you get the basic cool how I got into it the basic cool basic cool bicycle so it's got really 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 good writing because like, it's like you know what's going to happen they've set it up where you know you know, like towards the end, like you know it's gonna happen in your situation. You know what's gonna happen, but you don't want it to happen, so you don't want it to. You don't want to be right in this one scenario. You like always want to be right, but then you realize what's gonna happen, and you don't want to be right, but you know it's right, and then it happens, and you're like, wait, no, but this doesn't have to happen because this is gonna happen, and that made no sense. Okay, what is this voice? It's really hurting. <laughs> I like scented candles. Especially this cupcake one. I burn it every day. It's so random. I also love all the funny lines like my, the shock blanket. I love the 220, 221 Bay Street. I love how Sherlock plays the violin. The scene where Sherlock goes, punch me. No, well, hang on. I made a lot of Sherlock music plays today because I'm wearing my Sherlock shirt. The name's Sherlock Holmes and the address is 221 B Baker Street. Afternoon. I just need to talk about the, the ring. Yeah, I've still got questions uh, what for you. What now? I'm in shock. Look, I've got a blanket. For what? Punch me in the face. Punch you? Yes, punch me in the face. Didn't you hear me? I always hear punch me in the face when you're speaking, but it's usually subtext. Oh, for God's sakes. Oh. <sighs> Those scenes are always great. But I love when Sherlock teases John. Oh, I love John and Sherlock. They're hilarious. John Locke is bro TP. Bro TP. And the hat, the little hat that he put on, I love it. So I went and got this shirt yesterday. I was like, hey, the mom was like, we have to run some errands. I was like, okay, can we stop by Books a Million? Like, why? Because once you get me in Books a Million, it's going to take me a while before I get out because it's like my phantoms are everywhere and it's just like, it's my home. I don't want to live there. Can I? And so then I um, said, uh, well, I need to film a Sherlock video, and I don't really want to film a video where I'm wearing a one- Because I always wear fandom shirts in my videos, because I have fandom- uh, I have a fandom channel. And I don't want to wear a Once Upon Time shirt, even though that's my favorite fandom, and I'm so obsessed with it. Ooh, and that's basically kind of the reason I started watching Sherlock, because... Sherlock needs to be Once Upon Time. Because I needed to have something to watch while I was waiting for Once Upon Time to come back on. Though. But I know that sounds like really, like, snobby that I didn't want to wear, like, a Once Upon Time shirt in a different fandom video. I promise I'm not, it was just really a good excuse for me to get a Sherlock shirt, and it worked, so I got a Sherlock shirt. Yeah. And it had a tag on it, and this morning, there's just like this random nail in my closet, so I stuck it through the tag, and now there's a random Sherlock tag with Sherlock's face on it, staring at me every time I get ready, and it's a little bit creepy. I'm worried he's gonna judge me like, you were doing this and you were doing that. <laughs> like when he, that was Molly Hooper. Oh, uh, sure, like him. Oh, but she's, oh, so obviously. I love all different, I love all the different scenes of Sherlock and John and I love just, 
The show in general is really good. I don't know what I'm saying. Hopefully when I edit this it will be a lot better. <laughs> so I guess I'm just gonna like roll different things of how I react to Sherlock and different things that happen. I lost my phone. Um, oh, it's right here. Don't want to lose Huck. <gasps> I will find you. I will always find you. In the face. Punch you. Yes, punch me in the face. Didn't you hear me? I always hear punch me in the face when you're speaking, but it's usually subtitles. Oh, John. this video was funny for you okay bye so thank you guys so much for watching this video don't forget to leave a like it'll be greatly appreciated don't forget to subscribe to that strawberry bone below for more fangirly videos of me i'm going to try and attempt to list my fandoms once upon a time star wars hungry am sherlock look i have a lot of fandoms okay so yeah um don't forget to go and subscribe to all the girls that i did this collab with i will link their videos in the description once they're up and I will link their channels in the description so you guys should really go check them out and subscribe because they have really awesome channels. Also you can follow me on all my social medias they are linked in the description and they will also be on the end card at the end of this video. And thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you guys next week. I really am awkward and I need to fix that. Okay. Goodbye YouTube. What was that noise? Going out tonight changes into something red. Her mother. No. Oh, shoot, what was that?